Chicago Recovery Alliance is about assisting any positive change as a person defines it for him or herself. The Chicago Recovery Alliance offers naloxone and education about intervening successfully in opiate-related overdoses. Now there's all sorts of lore about what you do for overdoses. <laughs> to get people up and walk them around, to put ice on their genitals, to inject salt water, to stand them in a cold shower. And certainly any of those will work to help stimulate the nervous system and may help bring them around. But there is a very specific, very safe, totally effective antidote to heroin overdose. Not Naloxone. The name of it is Naloxone or Narcan, which is the brand name. It's available now in generic. Not Naloxone. It's been used in emergency rooms and by EMTs and paramedics for 30, 40 years. He's not dead, it's a heroin overdose. Let's break out the Narcan. Not Naloxone. An incredibly safe, incredibly specific treatment that specifically reverses the heroin overdose. Not Naloxone. A heroin overdose kills by going to a specific place in the brain, the place in the brain that tells you to keep breathing. And it turns that place off so you stop breathing. A couple of minutes without someone breathing can cause irreversible brain damage. So it's really important that it be intervened on immediately. Not Naloxone. This medication specifically kicks the heroin out of the brain so that that overdose effect goes away. Not Naloxone. It's one of the only, one of the only treatments in medicine that literally can't hurt anyone. The worst that's going to happen when someone's given naloxone is that they'll get dope sick. Check the expiration date. Keep naloxone and muscle syringes around whenever you're injecting. Store naloxone at room temperature and keep it away from the light. Light deactivates naloxone. Get your naloxone vial replaced after each use. Only use a new syringe to go into the naloxone vial. Always use with other people. You protect them, they protect you. When a person be ODing, they have them turn different colors, like dark blue or dark purple, like, and their lips turn their color. Their eyes go into the back of their head, and their white stuff come out their mouth. And they, yeah, and they start shivering all over. And she OD. I mean, she just went out. And it was like, the lips were turning blue. She wasn't breathing. She was going, her, her eyes were fluttering. <laughs> She was just going in and out, and I could tell. You know that they're gone, or they're leaving. The next minute you're waking up, and you're a little bit uh, disoriented of what's going on around you. I was scared. I didn't know what was really going on, but I knew they were dying. I remember saying, Dan, this is good. 